Today I'm Lao, so I'm sharing this Notion template for a trading journal in PSC. So here we have like three sections. There's bank transactions, trade logs, and portfolio. So let's start with bank transactions first. So this is where you add, let's say your deposit. So let's say we deposit 1 million for start of March. This will reflect in the balance sheet in the portfolio side. So if we also want to, to withdraw, the only thing that we need to do is just add a negative sign in the amount. So it will indicate that it's a withdrawal. So next is the trade logs. So there's three sections here, like open, closed, and all. For open, this is for our open positions. Closed is the closed trades and all. It, it shows all our trades. Let's use ACEN as a sample. So let's say I have ACEN. I uh, bought it at 8 pesos with 10,000 shares. So it will show an average cost which reflects also including the PSE fees. So that's already ca calculated at the background. So you'll also see here an entry and exit. So let's say entered today uh, 25th. So if I want to, let's say exit, I'll just add an end date. So let's say uh, at the 31st. So it will show here like the duration of the trade. So if I'm gonna close this, let's say I sold it at 10 pesos. So I have to change the status to closed. It will to the closed view. And this will show like all the the details about the trade. So let's say the percentage PL, the amount you earned in peso, then it's market value also tags it as one win then the amount of days held the the stock so i positions that the pnl is near to the price of the buy and sell because i know psc traders really like to share their positions and doesn't want to like include the average cost or market value so we can screenshot only this portion so yeah then we'll also see the changes here at the balance feed. So you'll see that the current balance is already showing the, the profit of 18,800 plus. It will also show the net PNL. So if I add, let's say, Annie at, let's say, 550 and I had to cut this at 520. I need to add the percent shares, let's say 10,000 as well. So yeah, it will it will show that the PNL is negative and it will reflect here the total net PNL that it minus. So in the portfolio side, what you can see here is the balance total balance it started so this is within the cash flow current balance includes the gain and loss similar to the net pnl percentage and peso we it also shows like the number of trades the accuracy accuracy is the number of wins versus the losses so it also next is it also shows like the best and the worst trade the, the RR. So RR is return rate or rate of return. So for me, this is very useful because it calculates like if my current strategies are making me money or not. So it kind of shows like there's a trajectory. So target for this one is this should be always above one. Best if it's like above 1.5 or two so that it shows that you're profitable. If it's going below one, it means that whatever you're doing, you're going to keep on losing your money. So you need to check your, your strategy. Then one thing why I wanted to use Notion, because let's say for my a ACN trade, I can click ACN and I can see all of this input, including like the transactions. But at the bottom side, you can see here that I can add notes. I can also add like screenshots of of the trade. So let's say I have this screenshot here. 
so I can just embed it and also add notes here that grade performance was amazing or got distracted while trading this some sort of that this is why what I like about notion because I can add like a lot of these notes within the trade logs so yep this is what's good about this and I think there's still a lot of things that we can improve with this trading journal but hopefully with this that I'm sharing to you guys this is already like good starter for traders who don't have yet any trade journal or let's say way of tracking their trades so this is a lot of help so yeah you can download this for free and if you want to add like a monetary it's up to you but you can just download put zero in the gum road and it's all for free